What's up, everybody? This is Crypto Muscle. Coming to you with another YouTube video. And this episode is, you guys know it, crypto fake news, right? Because everything I talk about, even though it's facts, and it's stuff that I bring up because it's already out there, still people still call this fake news, all right? All right but it's like, whatever, all right? I'll throw it out there. I don't give a shit. And uh, that's what it is because it's what's known out there already. It's a fact. And I don't know how this stuff's made up when it's already out there. So here we are, right? I'll begin with this with uh, Novatech, right? So Novatech is paying. But, <laughs> all right, there's a but. There's still no proof of just claims. There's a difference. Proof versus claims. That trading account has been paid out. Trading accounts so far... There might be claims, but no proof. Tons of proof of the bonus account paid out. Because, you know, those are small. And I guess you could say the the justification of it is that, well, you know, the bonus accounts are smaller, trading accounts are bigger, and they're trying to flush out all the, the payouts to all the bonus accounts first, all right, before they touch the trading accounts. I don't know, there's all these different explanations on why they're doing what they're doing. But the biggest speculation, and I, and I don't give a shit what people think about, is that, oh, they're just taking the trading account money and paying out the bonus account money and all that stuff. And then all in all, it, it doesn't matter. I mean, the point of it is they're running the money out regardless. And the whole thing with trading accounts is that it's not being paid out, all right? Only claims... And I would still like to see the, the proof of it, all right? And so with that, the Novatech death watch continues, all right? That's all I got to say. So um, let's see here. Yeah, I mean, that's what we got to do, the Novatech death watch. Oh, and check this out. Here's a prelude to tomorrow, all right? Let me see if I can find it here. Prelude to tomorrow. I'm going to get to this in a minute here. Oh, oh, drip, 48 cents. That's all I got to say is prelude to tomorrow as I do a full-on update on the drip network, the animal farm, and how that whole operation is just continuing to unravel and fall apart. So with that, let's move on to, um, let me see here. I got to move on to Solarium, all right? So here's Solarium, all right? The thing about Solarium is that I've said it from the get-go. Every platform will have a story. And every platform will play itself out. Every platform will have a beginning. Every platform will have an end. It's all a matter of attraction, attraction, all that stuff. And the thing about it is that here's some news, all right, that's really going to, you know, <laughs> show you that the whole thing is completely falling apart here, all right? Check it out here. The latest message from the Solarium CEO, the latest message, all right? Greetings, everyone. I would like to have a meeting with you later. Due to a very bad scenario, we had to make another difficult decision. All right, we failed as a company and have been making losses for two weeks. We tried to do everything to follow our plan, but we had no alternative. I want to apologize to each and every one of you to say that I am extremely frustrated and bad with this situation. With We have a negative balance in the last 15 days, and all the networks efforts have not reflected in positivity we do not give up honoring our word to help people who have not recovered their capital this remains our top priority many will not understand this decision but only me and the whole team know how serious this situation we are facing affiliate program is suspended indefinitely until the results of the products and energy production normalize our business again we Forgive me for not being able to pursue this dream. Wow, that is huge, all right? And what's the huge thing about this is that this thing has been falling apart since they first announced this whole change in the percentage daily payouts, this whole change with how they were going to go about the business with this whole credit bullshit stuff. This whole thing is a complete uh, waste now. <laughs> But solarium's green. It's green energy and stuff and renewable energy. But now it's a complete waste. 
the thing about it is, is that when they make these sort of changes, especially when they ask you to put more money in and they still come out losing, this, this thing is completely over now. There's no way they could come back from this. How can you normalize operations when you have something here, you take the money that was originally given to you, and you say, oh, we're going to give you back in credit, and then say, hey, but we need more money from you guys, and, and that way uh, we could normalize our operations again, but yet they still failed again. <laughs> I mean, that's why the trash, it's over. This is completely overdone, like the by, by way of that Elevate Pass, right? Elevate Pass, because, uh, you know, miss, uh, you know, misused the funds, whatever they did, it, it's over, all right? Simple as that. But let me just throw this out there, because your boy, Marco, was all about this. Oh, how great it is, and oh, man, you know, it's so real. This is so real. This is this, 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 and this. All this bullshit stuff, right? But not a single word came out of him. Just like every time a platform shuts down, not a single word comes out of him that talks about any of this stuff, yet he preaches all about it, and then once it goes down, he just moves on to the next one as if nothing happened, What it, like a bitch that he is, all right? So that's your boy Marcus for you, and uh, snake in the grass, try to act all religious and all that stuff, screw him, all right? This is what you guys get out of this, all right? So dear affiliates, the withdrawals will be temporarily out of operation so that we can conduct an internal audit. Soon it will return normally. It will never return. It will not return. Especially with this whole credit bullshit. And they're going to ask you to put more money in. Probably again for the third time. All right. Then screw all that. All right. Solarium is squashed. It's over with. So with that, I wanted to share that with you guys. All right. So Novatech Death Watch continues. Drip. Death Watch, all right? I just gave you a little piece hint there. Solarium, oh, it's dead. There's no way they could come back from this. All right, and now let's move on to, uh, let's see here. Look at a couple of these uh, high-yield platforms that I'm in. One I'm in, well, a couple that I'm in, and there's one I wanted to point out that I wasn't in, but I thought it was very curious. <laughs> Get it? Curious? Cur Hero Club. All right, this thing started back on December 20th, right? And they have these decent hourly plans where you can make up to, you know, a certain percent a day, right? Almost, almost joined it. And then, uh, funny thing was about these guys is that this is the second time they've done this now. So they said that they're going to relaunch the Kiro Club. It has been running for more than 20 days in stable mode, but our platform is forced to restart the system for further work. Uh, the team is, uh, let's see, uh, the club is determined to work seriously and do everything for the club uh, to further stable and develop cl the club. Uh, we invite all care partners to long-term cooperation. So all previous deposits were reset to zero. It was inevitable for the restart of the club uh, to return previous deposits. What do you got to do here? Top up the balance by 25%. <laughs> all right. You know, so you got to add another 25%. And notify the admin that you did that, which will probably just, you know, screw you over anyway. So that's Kiro Club, right? This is the second time they've rebooted it now because they've already done this. And now they're restarting it again. All right. So I say don't fall for this uh, unless you just want to lose your money. That's, uh, that's on you. Now, Bitify, all right, or dreams come true, all right? Uh, Bitify notify me you know the email says that my account um cycled out right that's that's what happens when you, you know you, you know notification that is cycled out so it says right here you know it's expired the deposit amount so that's that right oh wrong one let me go uh, where am i at here where am i at? let me go here there we go so uh, with that, I still have a little bit of a balance left, $45. So we're going to see if it's still functioning, all right? Because I've been asked, are they still paying? And um, as of the last time I talked about Bitify, it was. And at the time of this video, we're going to find out now. I got notification that my uh, deposit has finished. So we're going to see here. Let's find out. 
right now. Is it going to give me, uh, you know, busting on my pants scenario? We're going to find out right now. We're get ready, get ready, get ready. And... What? Uh, not processed. You might have entered an amount below the minimum or your wallet address has not been provided. Oh, you know what? Wasn't it? Let me see what the FAQ payout was here. Don't tell me it's like $50 minimum for withdrawal. $5. Okay. So, it says $5 for all. But I don't know what the minimum was for Bitcoin unless it's, it's just $5 across the board. But, um, but I, I don't know. I, <laughs> Let me go to the... Uh, I guess it's pending now, right? Because, let's see. Because my address is there. And, yeah, so that's that. I guess, I guess it's not paying now then, uh, is what I'm assuming. So that's that. Uh, Exto-Extamine. Is this the lone gunman now all of a sudden? So, uh, well, I, I can't do nothing right now. I think it still has an active deposit here. Yeah, it still has an active deposit, so it's not a full 24 hours yet before I could just cycle it back in and do it all over again like I've been doing for quite some time now. So, x 2 x has been paying. It's still paying, and uh, they're still doing good. I guess Bitify could be the end. I got to find out because I thought it might have been $50 for Bitcoin. Um... Because I've always been withdrawing bigger than 50 bucks. That's why I can't really tell if this is not paying or not. See, it's always been 90. And I cycled out. Uh, this is a Tron address for 688. It's always been 6750. See how it is that I've been pulling out 90, 6750. Oh, there it is. $45. Never mind. $45. So it did pay there. All right, so... There it is. That's confirmation that now that it's pending, right, that, uh, yeah, maybe, I guess the run is done. So that's that for you. And, uh, yeah, cover Kiro Club, cover this. And so, yeah, Spitify, the run is done. Unless Divine Intervention comes back in again and sets upon me and, and says, you know what, Crypto Muscle, they will be paying. And I'll say, well, shit, if they're paying, I'll, I'll go back in. But it looks like it's not. So I guess the timing of of this, of my deposit uh, cycled out, plus now that it shows pending, that uh, it's supposed to be instant, right? And, you know, when I mean instant, I mean instant, which wasn't the case. So I guess that's what it is. Couldn't, couldn't bust up my pants today. I guess not a good day to do that. But yeah, so uh, it's been a good run, and uh, unless divine intervention comes in and blesses Bitify, since we're all about, you know, the holier-than-thou type scenarios here, especially with your boy Marcos, who's really a snake in the grass, then man, whew, this is a interesting day here on the Crypto Muscle Network here, sharing to you the great fake news. And this is what it's all about. So, Bitify comes to an end. And the death watch continues on Novatech. Because there's still no proof of uh, payouts, all right? Of uh, the trading accounts, all right? No, there was trading accounts. I'm waiting for that. I'm still waiting for that. And until then, I don't give a shit about the bonus account payouts. Those are small. I want to see the thousands come out with the trading accounts. And it's, it's well beyond the timeline scenarios of the business day, what, 14 business days, all the other stuff, you know, and it's a, it's curious to see how fast the bonus accounts are going to be caught back up to where they used to be in terms of the amount of days it takes to pay them out or not. So they're paying, but it's from like a week before when it used to be a lot shorter than that. So is Quickie Pay quick? Uh, I don't know. We'll see. So that's that. Solarium's done. All right, it's done, done. It's buried now. And so, other than that, comment down below. Links down below. Let me know what you think about all this stuff, and I'll see you in the next one.